Hello everyone. Welcome to a quick Walgreens haul slash updates video. So didn't do much at Walgreens this week because I didn't get a booster coupon for the current week. I know a lot of you scored that really amazing spend 40 or $20 in Walgreens cash. So I hope that you got some great goodies out there. The positive thing, and I always say is it'll come back at some point hopefully i know some accounts are not getting coupons and my fingers are crossed that they will but this week i got this spend 25 earn 10 dollars in walgreens cash booster so um it's always okay to take a little break in the the couponing you know your couponing world and just do other things and then come back the next week you never know what will pop up in your account so i hope that you guys got those coupons i received mine on wednesday sometimes they don't pop up until Thursday so if you don't see it there just keep checking and my fingers are crossed that all of you guys get a really good booster to work with next week I'm already looking at deals so hopefully some good deals to to uh, utilize that but I wanted to share with you guys an update on Walgreens pickup because I attempted to do well I did do a pickup deal so I don't know if you caught my earlier video this week regarding the online deals and how you know it used to be ten dollars before the coupons were taken off and you could do curbside pickup but it's still not for me it's still it has to be ten dollars after all of your um, coupons are applied because I tried to do it with a Maybelline deal that you're gonna see in this video that I did um, and I mentioned in my digital deals video and it still said that I was like $6 and something cents short because it was like ten thirty eight, and then there was a seven off two digital. So it was only computing that $3 and something cents toward my $10 amount for curbside pickup. So I don't know, a lot of you guys told me you were able to place orders. It would not allow me to place the order. So let me know what's going on in your neck of the woods. If it's working, if it's not, I'm hoping it's a temporary thing. If it's working for some, it makes me think that it's just some kind of like you know error glitch in the computer system and you know that's the way that it's going to be but for me it's still not working it must be ten dollars after all the coupons not before coupons so wanted to share a couple of good deals there's a great paper product deal with a code that you can do for online um, for curbside pickup and it's a stock up deal so if you're stocking up you're definitely gonna be hitting that ten dollar amount and you can go ahead and pick them up there's a great in-store deal it is a register reward deal but it is an amazing deal I think it is on um, it's a great stock up deal especially if you're you know like to have a lot of toothbrushes and stock up on them and speaking of toothbrushes um, definitely take care of your teeth I just cracked a tooth. I'm actually on my way to the dentist right now to get a crown. So just a little reminder because I'm a little late tardy to my cleaning for my teeth. So try and, you know, keep on top of that stuff if you can. I do for the kids. For myself, I don't. But I got to get better at that. But this is a really great deal. And you can pay with Walgreens Cash. I'm going to show you the receipt. And then I did grab some somewhat cheap um, Revlon. Or excuse me. It's actually Maybelline Eye, which we don't usually get Maybelline Eye products with a high value digital coupon. So let me go home and show you what I got. So friends, I'm going to go through the really quick order that I did. Everything was, well, there's not a ton here, but the paper products and the Maybelline Eye were an in-store pickup, so online pickup deal. This deal you have to do in-store. It's a really good one, especially if you need some toothbrushes. So I'm going to go ahead and start with this one. These are the Oral-B. You want to make sure you're getting the indicator. They have another one, another four-pack that is priced at $10 per pack. These are on sale for $5 each. They're also included in a buy three, earn a $5 register reward. So remember, register reward deals have to be done in store. Walgreens cash deals you can do in store or you can also do online for curbside pickup. So I got three of these packs for $15. Now, if you go into your Walgreens account, there's a five off three digital coupon that does include Oral-B toothbrushes. So go ahead and use that coupon. You're gonna end up paying a total of $10. And guys, I rolled some Walgreens cash. This is a great deal to roll Walgreens cash. And then I got the $5 register reward for doing this deal. So it ends up making the three packs pre-tax $5 or just $1.66 per pack.
And just to show you, here's the receipt. So I did this all on one receipt. We have the $5 times three for $15 for the three packs of toothbrushes, the five off three digital, $10, subtotal $1.31 in tax. So in total with tax, it was $11.31, but you can see this is a perfect deal to use $10 in Walgreens cash. So if you've been building up that Walgreens cash by using those booster coupons or things like that, these are the deals to do. The next transaction, I ended up using $20 in Walgreens cash to stock up on some paper products. And the Scott paper products ended up being $3 per pack with a digital store coupon and an online code. So here we go. First deal, everything else I did in a curbside pickup order. I went in store, I got a receipt print out. So I'm not sure how your stores work with curbside pickup if they don't give receipts, if they do give receipts. I didn't have an A about a rebate, so it didn't really matter. But first thing that I picked up were two of these Maybelline quad eyeshadows, which the light there is kind of getting into them. They're $6.99, buy one, get one 50%. And I had a seven off two digital coupon in my Walgreens account. So I went ahead and I clipped that coupon, grabbed two of these, total was 1048. After the seven off two digital coupon, it was 348 for both or $1.74 each. Now I tried to just do my pickup order with these. And when I tried to do that, it said that I had to add $6 and something more cents into my cart. Um, to do a curbside pickup order. So it's still for me after coupons, not $10 before coupons. It's showing that it has to be $10 after coupons. Um, so I'm not sure if it's just certain regions, certain stores, a temporary glitch, a permanent thing. I guess we'll have to see. And then finally, it's a great week to stock up on Scott paper products. So I got three packs of the six roll paper towels two packs of the Comfort Plus. They're all $5 each. The cool thing to the deal is we have a $1.25 Walgreens store coupon. So I clipped that coupon. Now for each pack, it took off $1.25. And since I got five, that was $6.25 in savings. Now the cool part is I use the code SENIOR20. Senior 20 took off an additional 75 cents per pack or $3 and 75 cents in total for all five packs. So final price for all three was $15 or just $3 per pack, which is a pretty good deal for Scott paper products. And again, I did this deal paying with $20 in Walgreens cash. And here we go with the receipt for all to see. Um, of course, curbside pickup receipts look a little bit different, especially when you use um, different coupon codes and things like that. The totals kind of get, or the single products get a little jumbly. But the 20% off, the Senior 20 code took 20% off of the Scott products. You can see it on the right-hand side there, S20%. There are the two Maybelline products. We've got all five Scott paper products. The only coupons that I use, it's showing $3.50 coupons, but it was a seven off of two, but it took $3.50 off each Maybelline item. $18.48 was my subtotal with some tax. It was $20.71. So I didn't get any booster coupon this week, but I was able to grab some staple items and I was able to use some of my Walgreens cash that I've built up. I think a lot of people are finding that they have a ton of Walgreens cash from those boosters and every week they keep just paying out of pocket and not utilizing that Walgreens cash. Use it on things that you need. I'm not saying go into store and just start using it frivolously, but use it on things you need and this is a great week to do it, especially with that Senior 20 code for the Scott Paper products. 75 cents per pack is some great savings, um, additional savings to grab anyway. So thanks so much for watching this video. Let me know how curbside pickup is at your store. Is it $10 before coupons or $10 after coupons? And hopefully we'll get that situated soon where we'll, all will be doing the same couponing and it will be universal and not certain areas having crazy changes. So thanks so much for watching guys. Take care.